jury has rendered its verdict. It is a disappointment. It is a major determination in the criminal justice system, and there's just no doubt playing it. However, uh, we are going to go forward. The process is not over until it's over. Uh, we are going to have the appellate courts review everything. Uh, my guess is that will take nine months, uh, and Mr. DeWeese has made it very clear we must go forward. We will go forward. But to pretend that this is not a disappointment uh, would be disingenuous. It is, and I am very saddened uh, for Mr. DeWeese uh, because I believed the position we set forth. I don't think this is doing any good uh, in the legislature. I think the legislature has been under assault for years, and this mayhem has got to come to a stop. I might add parenthetically that I am still a member of the state legislature and that my petitions are out in my precincts. And I believe that in the court of public opinion, I shall be favorably received to some substantial degree. That's up to the voters. But I will certainly continue to run for renomination and for re-election. And I certainly have faith that as the protocols of the ensuing weeks go forward, the appellate tribunals will give me every opportunity for Mr. Gustavus and I to make our case. No, I'd like to thank you very much. I'd like to thank you very much for your civility during this entire process. No, you require thank you. my law to resign once you're sentenced. Bill, do you feel believe that you've been wrong? I certainly feel that I did nothing wrong. And I think that a Western Pennsylvania Green Fed Washington County jury would have found me innocent. I believe that Mr. Fina wanted me tried by his peers, not by my own peers. Thank you. You plan on taking your seat tomorrow during the budget address? Absolutely. I'm still a member of the General Assembly. In fact, I've asked Mr. Darmody to appoint me to the committee to escort the governor. Do you have anything to say to him?